Pedro uh, is in your hands. Can you tell us what he has? Yes, he had a very severe lesion in the accident uh, this afternoon, but uh, he had m severe trauma and uh, without brain lesion. Brain lesion have been excluded and uh, he has some, uh, an important fracture of the femur of the left leg and uh, he had a great important blood loss from the femur but now he is under control even from the for the blood loss and uh, now the he, he also had some important respiratory impairment mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and uh, at the beginning when he came uh, here in the hospital uh, but he is now under control his breath is quite normal he is unconscious with drugs conscious for drugs and now he has been transferred to the intensive care unit where we, he will be monitored for the next uh, hours so the situation is severe trauma but under control Pedro heeft een zware letsel opgelopen, geen hersenbeschadiging. Zijn linkerbeen heeft een ernstige fractuur en hij heeft veel bloedverlies geleden. Ook had hij ademhalingsproblemen, maar die zijn alle onder controle en hij is stabiel. Pedro is niet bij kennis, hij wordt kunstmatig in slaap gehouden. Hij is niet in onmiddellijk levensgevaar. Wat verwacht je expect after this conditions? Because now he's conscious. Uh, is he going to uh, get well? And uh, how long is that going to take? We can't. Make uh, we can't make forecast in this very precise way in this moment.